These frogs are not happy, but you probably don't want to make frogs afraid or stressed. Just like me, you probably want to see them happy and living their best froggy lives. But frogs and toads can't talk. They use their body to communicate, and it can sometimes be hard to understand or interpret what they're trying to say. So here are things frogs are trying to tell you and how to respond. Peeing on you, crouching or squishing down to the ground, hopping away, playing dead, trying to escape your hands. These are all signs of fear and stress. Frogs spend most of the day making one of two decisions, eat or flee. You're big, they can't eat you. And so you naturally come off as a potential predator. Therefore, many frogs will try to flee you. But there are some times where frogs will realize that you're not a threat and will let you hang out with them. The best way to respond to frog stress is to respect them. If they're trying to escape, leave them alone. Avoid touching frogs and wear gloves if you absolutely have to pick them up. If you're observing them in the wild and they seem comfortable with you around and they're not showing any signs of fear or stress, then enjoy watching them live their best lives. But you may be making other mistakes, so find out 10 things not to do with frogs in this video.